Here we go, just a quick little update. The Austrian forces have now moved and let's just see if we can get this right. Now what, I, <coughs> what I decided to do was flip the formation counters over so I can see the numbers because it is just not gonna be uh, convenient for me to keep track of everybody. And I did randomize these and I've got them all listed down here so uh, leader's name, formation counter number. So I'll know who they are. I being both players, but I'll know who they are. You may not necessarily know who they all are. So here we go. Uh, we uh, popped a scout. I decided just to put the scout name on here. It, it, you're going to know it's a scout by the speed it's moving at. And we have decoy counters out. So it's one, two of these are decoy counters. So the French don't know which one. And we have uh, the uh, left core moving down this way or this way. And we move the uh, Lichten, Lichtenstein, uh, his forces, let me focus that for you. His forces down here. And these guys advance down here and I split, put a, put a decoy, one of these two is a decoy out as well. And then move the center forces and that is the Allies' first turn. Alexander is already nervous. And we will continue on for the next, uh, after the movement phase. So we're done with the movement phase for turn one. And we are now gonna go to the non-fire phase, close combat, rally, which there will be none of for the first player. So we are, uh, now ready to start the second player and it's uh, time for my bedtime, so we're done.